Well, a day has passed, and the weather turned kind of crappy. But uh, I did go get to check on some of my settlements, and I thought about maybe bringing some stuff here. Not like I have anything to spare at any of my other places either, but maybe to build some things. kind of like this little outpost up here around this satellite tower. It came with a generator. That was kind of nice. kind of wonder if there was some way I could have salvaged the turret. I don't know if I could have snuck past it and gotten in there, or maybe just killing all the raiders uh, would have made the turret not hostile anymore. I don't know, I mean, there's, there was no, like, terminal or anything controlling it. It's just shooting at me. Anyway, I don't, I don't know. Doesn't matter. Destroying it, I got to get the parts from it, regardless. It's, uh, I don't know. I may do something with that. We'll see. So many settlements, if there's gonna be this many, I'm not gonna have materials to build everywhere. At least not completely. Like, but like I say, that, that stuff, I had some stuff already there. Uh, I could get a beacon up for a minute, just draw a couple people to just come man the place. Use it as, uh, like I say, a, you know, just a watering hole for people passing through. That, that'd be cool. I don't mind having a bunch of those around. I remember I was, I was talking in the last one about this, uh, that sounds like a Mr. Gutsy yelling over a, a loudspeaker or a bullhorn or something. This. <laughs> Man, where do these guys come up with this stuff? We're going to see what's going to happen here. God. This looks like a uh, uh, General Atomics Galleria. So I guess this is uh, a mall or a showplace or something. Thieves, trespassers, and communists. That's it. Gotta love the patriotic robots. See a dog meat being all sneaky. Alright, this I I'm really I've been uh, I've been looking forward to this. I really have. Are you tough enough to take all the chaps? Uh oh. Um, yeah. Uh, yes, yes, that's right. <clears throat> Splendid. Well, <laughs> let me be the first to welcome you to your new assignment. Once you've had a chance to get settled in, you should report to the director. His office is located in the statue in the center of the plaza. The Galleria is currently closed to the public, but staff and employees are permitted on the grounds, of course. If you have any questions, I'd be happy to assist you. Why is the Galleria closed? I'm sorry, but due to pending litigation, I am unable to comment. Please direct your inquiries to the General Atomics Legal Affairs Division. Who's the director? General Atomics Patented Director Management System, DMS, is responsible for coordinating the actions of the robots here at the Galleria. The director allows the Galleria to operate autonomously without the need for human intervention. What is this place? The General Atomics Galleria is the shopping center of tomorrow today. Our wide array of stores are staffed entirely by the General Atomics line of robots, showcasing the reliability and versatility of a robotic workforce. Come in and experience the General Atomics difference. That's all. Very well. Enjoy your visit. Remember, okay. You are the pride of General Atomics. This is going to be interesting. Step right up. All right, so we have a completely robot manned mall here. All employees, report suspicious behavior to the director immediately. Right this way. Um, I see dead bodies. Yeah, something tells me not to do that right now. I don't know, maybe we'll get back to that. The director has sanctioned the use of lethal force against looters. 
hardware shop, robot shop, or something. Here's a diner. Stealing, okay. Right. I don't want to piss anybody off yet. I, I want to check this out. I'm kind of curious. He's looking at his clipboard. Would you like a table? What's with all the bodies? We do have a lot of satisfied customers, don't we? They almost never leave. <laughs> I still have one booth left. It'd be my pleasure to serve you. Sure. Right this way. <laughs> this is this is what I live for right here. Oh man. You gotta love this. This is awesome. Alright, so this is the last table not manned by skeletons, huh? Alright. Wait, what? At Handy Eats, serving you is our code. <laughs> serving, uh, <laughs> serving me as food. Oh no. Alright. I don't want to piss off any of the other robots. Oh wow, the robots like fall apart as you hit them. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so apparently the robots took their directives literal. Like you need to serve customers, so they literally try to serve the customers. I don't think you want to eat here. This is this is awesome. Get off me. There we go. Actually, these robots might be worth killing, huh? Uh oh. Hey! hey. <laughs> the cook's after me, too. The <laughs> robots just go ballistic. I'm actually about to die here, aren't I? Oh, wow, he's got a fl <laughs> He's a cook with a flamethrower? This is awesome. So, if I'd have been. If I'd have asked for charbroiled, I would have got. Uh, the cook would have come over and tried to uh, roast me or something. I use my critical. I'll take all that though. I mean that's kind of worth it, but oh this is this is too funny. So what tells me that all right, so I had to refer to the legal department if I wanted to know why this place was closed. Apparently there's litigation cuz the robots have essentially killed everyone who came here for some reason or something. It's okay. I I kind of get it. Let's see if I can have all this stuff now. I can. Mm, cool. Alright, so once you clear the robots out, I guess you can uh, take all their stuff. Let's see. Gallery is currently closed. There was no reservations or wait list. The principles of Handy Eats. Serving you is our code. So they took that literally. Food is fresh, fast, flavorful. Oh no. This is so bad. <laughs> this is awesome. Laws laws like this are subject to miscalculation and prioritization problems. Yeah, I'd say so. I think the uh, the priorities and miscalculations are definitely a, a, a thing with these robots. Alright, well this is all kind of worth it right here. Definitely take all this stuff. This is the kind of thing I really get a kick out, kick out of, and fall out. I really do. This kind of just really bad humor. It's just, it's awesome. <laughs> so 
So mankind's best efforts at technological advancement always result in <laughs> him dying. I mean, seriously. Always result in man's death, and they just they just never learn. It's not just war that never changes, you know? Maybe this is all just part of it, I don't know. Alright, so uh Well, at least it's not raining. I'm imagining the story's going to be somewhat the same, but uh, here's an actual explorable area here. What is this? Back alley bowling. Okay. All right. So what sets these robots off? Five thousand dollars. All right. Do you take caps? Bottle caps? Of course not. Legal tender only. Do you mind if I just take a look around? Oh, all right. I suppose we aren't that busy. Go ahead. Mm, cool. All right. So is that the equivalent of killing the robots? They're not not going to go hostile, go berserk on me. So oh, can you have these? Hmm. Huh. But there's got to be some crafting material in those things, right? Got to be good for something. Wow, this is really well done. This really is. They all died bowling. I wonder. I wonder how. Or I wonder why. For not bowling a strike or something. Who knows? Are you able to bowl? I guess not really. Oh well. Worth a try, right? So if you roll a split or a gutter ball or anything, the robots kill you <laughs> or something? I don't know. Alright, that's cool. This might be worth coming to check back on later. This bowling alley. wonder if there's a way to... Uh... That's it. Maybe get get this place open, operational or something. Be interesting if you could find some way to bowl. That would be cool. That'd be a neat mini game for a certain score. Maybe for a prize or something to beat. You know, hey. bowl a perfect three hundred and get I don't know a trophy or something. You know, something like that. I don't know, whatever. Jingles the Moon Monkeys. Is there a is there a trophy for collecting a certain number of those? Wouldn't doubt it. We're finding all all the Moon Monkeys. Maybe if you just tell them you can't afford it, they just straight up kill you. Oh sweet, quantum the quantum that'll work. Almost makes it worth it right there. Hmm. Pool balls, huh? Might have use for those. I think I want to set up a pool table back in my clubhouse at uh, Sanctuary. Actually, I, I really think I do want to do that. Hmm? I think I think I will. Welcome to Back Alley Bowling. Please have a look around. Right on. Damn, we would have had to fight all these robots? Yeah, I'm, I think it's probably a good thing we uh, we didn't piss them off. Enjoy your day at the Galleria. Glad they're letting me just walk around and loot all this stuff. Might as well just take it all. Might as well. I know that duct tape is valuable. Adhesive. It's apparently like the one thing that everybody just can't get enough of. With me so far, it's been copper. Seems like everything needs copper and you only have like a small handful of it. There's probably some really good source of copper later on. I'm, I'm hoping so anyway. 
with mine running across them. Alright, I have found magazines and bathrooms before. That was a big thing in Fallout 3. Every once in a while you'd open a, a stall and find a skill book or something laying right there. Oh, there's... Well, it's not a magazine, but it's a stash of caps. I'll take it. But whatever material you get for these bowling balls, um, I need to remember there's, there's about 500 of them here. So if I ever need a bunch of that, whatever it is, fiberglass, plastic, whatever, then uh, I know where to go. Come here and clear the place out. Let's see if we can't. Uh, supervisor, okay. I think that's who I'm supposed to be, is the supervisor, right? No, that didn't work. I know it's a little more tedious, but it's kind of fun to me. Doing this by deduction. Solving it kind of like a puzzle. That's why I've always done it, so I don't know. Just me. No, I thought that would have been it right there. We have two likenesses. Oh, there we go. Sweet. The Galleria is to showcase the range and versatility of these robots. And to serve as a model for... Sh more shopping centers, I guess. Alright. Customer's relation duly notes the concerns in your recent reports. The robot's original programming are all your fault. <laughs> Any problems they're having is your fault. They're malfunctioning because you're interfering with them and they're not programmed to uh, um, take that into a, an account, all right? And so you are uh, authorized to provide an instant settlement, <laughs> legal settlement to anyone who's basically had a family member killed by these berserk robots. Okay, and then it gives you an override code. I guess you can shut the whole place down. I guess if you did that, you could loot everything. Okay. And this would have been the day the bombs fell. You'd have make your way to the director's office in the statue. Present yourself by that code name, 18 Alpha. Present your ID. Okay. Believe that the director has been compromised and may have been responsible for the death of your predecessor. Alright, so either some kind of Chinese virus <laughs> infected the place to kill Americans as they came, or somebody, I don't know, mispro- or something, anyway. But, uh, so apparently all the, uh, robots together have been slightly misprogrammed to, uh, somehow take their, their programming wrong and kill everybody as a result. I wonder if there's a way to get this place working again. Or working properly. Like, I see, you know, if it's a bunch of shops, what about merchants? I wouldn't mind opening up a mall full of merchants. Even if they are robots. As long as they're not berserk trying to kill me, I'm cool with that. Doesn't matter who sells me stuff, just sell me stuff. I didn't mind buying from a robot in New Vegas. I'll buy from robots here, too. Definitely take all. Oh, look at all this. Sweet. All the good stuff Please here. Have a look around. I am. I'm definitely having a look around right now as we speak. I'll be taking that microscope right there. I see it. I'm sorry, sir. With the lanes closed, we're not opening for business today. 
This robot is intentionally trolling my loot. Get out of my way. Light bulbs. That is gold for me. Copper. You get at least one piece of copper with that. I think a light bulb gives you glass and copper, and then a broken light bulb just gives you copper or something like that. Hey. I think I can afford to put at least a um, turret up at my new little settlement up there. That, uh, that, whatever that is, that broadcast tower or something. Oh man, baby rattle and a baby bottle. I'm glad they don't have little baby skeletons around. I guess that would have been just a little too, too real. Too much of a downer. But, uh, well that says enough right there, anyway. I think. That's where it kind of hits home. I mean, it's all fun and games and everything until the reality of it sets in. And, and they'll do that. They'll do that off and on through the game. You know, in, in all the dark humor and everything else kind of gets lost. The, uh, the ugly truth of just what an impact, uh, you know, full-out nuclear war would, would have. I mean, seriously. Change your mind. Yeah, I'm going to... I think I'll head back here. We may come back and check if I remember... In fact, if we don't do it for a while, um, one of y'all remind me to head back here and check the bowling alley. Some other time. Kind of curious. Who's there? Are, are you... Are you a customer? <laughs> <laughs> a robot with OCD. <laughs> you can't move anything in his store at all. I'm sure that sends him, makes him berserk. Sends him off the deep end. If you touch anything in his store. That's funny. This has got to be a running joke or something. People died waiting. Waiting for their... 17. All right, what do we got? Number 18. Did you not read the signs? Please, OJ! <laughs> 19. All right, well, that one we found on the bench was 22, so let's see if we can't get served here. 20. Almost. Let's try this again. Number twelve. <laughs> he starts back. Are you serious? Wow. Alright, so now what's this? That's stealing. Come on in. Right. Come on in. That's stealing too. Welcome to Slocum's Joe. Can I set you up with a nice Well, just in case I piss this robot off, I guess I better do some healing. 
This is awesome. I, 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 I don't know who thinks of this, but this is just, this is awesome. Is that all you've got? I'd offer you some of our world-famous donuts, but I'm afraid they went stale a few weeks ago. Pretty much everything else has, too, come to think of it. So, the coffee's about all that's left. Can I get you some? Is there a gas leak in here? Uh, yes. I put in a work order about, oh, 50 years ago. They certainly are taking their time with it, aren't they? <laughs> I can't resist. Sure. So coming right up. Here at Slocum's Joe, all of our coffee is heated to a perfect 200, 100, 100 <laughs> degrees Fahrenheit. You might want to stand back. I am getting out of here. 200, 100, 100. Holy oh, crap. This is, this is awesome. He <laughs> said 200, 100, 100. <laughs> No, I don't think so. No, thanks. All right. Well, come again. Okay. I probably won't do that. It's still stealing, huh? All right. Whatever. 200. 100. 100. <laughs> the freaking 2 million degree coffee. That's... Man. Oh. This is, uh... This is totally worth it, man. Totally worth it. Alright, so let's see what we got going on up here. I guess this is where the guy who's been yelling through the bullhorn. Yeah. Reporting in, as ordered. Reporting in? Wait, the grand reopening? Are you grand reopening supervisor 18 Alpha? You're late. Grand reopening? All right, listen up. The grand reopening protocol will distribute software upgrades to all employees and reopen the Galleria. Manual authorization of the grand reopening requires authentication, so I'm going to need to see your ID. Sir. Wait, manual activation? Is there any other kind? Automatic activation was scheduled for January 1st, 2078. Wait. Analyzing. Corrupt task detected. Task scheduler repaired. Now executing previously scheduled task. Accessing protocols. All units, stand by for the grand reopening. I don't know who sabotaged their original program or whatever. I guess that's me. I could still shut it down if I want to. I don't know. It sounds like it's working now. Okay, remember what I was saying about the bowling? Now, seriously, I want to come back and check that bowling alley now. See if there's not a hidden mini game in the game or something. I don't know. Wouldn't put it past them. Try something like that. We'll see. Be worth checking out. Wonder if, uh,. Maybe we can come back at some point in time and this place will be kind of cleaned up, too. What if a workbench popped up here? What kind of friggin' um, settlement would this make? 
Oh, this would be badass. What else do you have? I suppose I could whip up a few things. Wow. Okay, so they all become uh, merchants now, huh? Talk about a source of stuff. Actually, I think we'll go check out some of the other ones, too. I can probably afford to sell uh, some of this junk, actually. Oh, wow, we're, we're, I don't even remember getting that. Oh, it's got an extended... Hmm, yeah, I might have to keep some of this stuff. I probably ought to keep some of that for uh, followers and stuff. Hmm. That's fine. Really, I just wanted to see what they had. Okay. And now, I, and I can have all this stuff now too. Okay, cool. Cap stash. I don't know where that came from. I'll take it. Welcome to Penelia's Bakery. My name is Crisp. Can I take your order? <laughs> what do you sell? This is a bakery. <laughs> Having a bad day? You too can enjoy the benefits of personality subroutine 37. Existential despair when you buy your own General Atomics robot. Pick one up today. Now, did you want anything? This is awesome. Let's see what you got. Let me know if you want anything. An emo bot, man. <laughs> this is this is man. Oh, I just can't say enough. So worth it. Taurus. I don't know about you guys, but this may be one of the better videos in this series, honestly. This this place is... This kind of stuff right here is the heart and soul of this franchise, really. Nice. It's okay if I touch stuff now? I guess so. So they were all given, like, disorders. OCD and all kinds of stuff. Just, oh, that's that's awesome. Oh, that's considered stealing, huh? Okay, well, I won't take that. I'm going to look around a bit. Those lamps, those are going to come in handy. I can have everything else, though. Wow, good selection of just clothes and stuff here. Seriously. Keep this in mind, too, if I ever decide to just go styling with regular clothes. I don't even know what some of the stuff will get. Oh, I'll take those, too. I don't even know what uh, it'll all give me. I just... Hey... It'll be good for something. I know that. Alright. Enough nosing around. So I guess this would be a armor dealer? Or at least at least clothes, right? Good day. Can I help you with anything, Mum? What do you have for sale? Not much, I'm afraid. Our suppliers are dreadfully late, and it looks like most of the appliances have rusted. But I could offer you jewelry, clothes, perhaps some housewares? I'll take a look, sure. We have an excellent selection of merchandise. At least we used to. <laughs> oh, he sells a little of everything. Oh, nice. Even find vases and stuff. 
Raises your intelligence by two, huh? Okay. Hmm. All right, well, this was really, really cool. Oh, man. Okay, well, note to anyone who hasn't explored this yet, you might not want to go aggro any of the robots till you manage to uh, get the place working. Take that. I wonder if some of the stuff uh, respawns, too. Imagine that. If I had to come in here, How can I assist you? I'd be barters Are too, huh? Your robots for sale? Our floor models? Why, no, those are for display only. Normally, I'd be happy to offer you your very own Mr. Handy kit, uh, some assembly required, but I'm afraid we're all out of stock. I'm sure the new models will be arriving any day now. Let's see what you have General Atomics for all things robotics. Steel and oil. Alright, source of oil. Might as well. Didn't cost much. Anyway, good to keep in mind if I ever need some of that stuff. That's that's cool. Oh, okay, this is the room I first broke into. Alright. Well, Got a bunch more merchants. Welcome to Madness. I'm afraid our boxing instructor, the champ, is a little under the weather today. If there's anything you need, I'm sure Daddy can help you. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay. Well, I'm definitely glad I didn't step in here. Okay, I probably don't want to piss off all these robots, do I? Finally have them all in working order. Probably wind up with a couple Mr. Gutsies on my ass if I get caught <laughs> messing with any of that, so. Got a pretty good amount of stuff, though, to, uh, I don't know, stock one of my settlements, and that's probably what I'm going to go do. Go back and uh, piddle around with a couple of them, then we'll get back, uh, I don't know, somewhere over by here, I guess, and, uh, and head out. We still have a farm to go rescue or help or uh, I don't know what what help they need from us but we'll go see got it oh, there's another terminal oh stim oh nice Okay, I'll take all that. Okay, and after a whole yes. bunch of tries, finally got it. Yeah, that, that, that took a minute for some reason. Anywho, start manager sale. Oh, maybe I should have known that a little while ago before I went. And, well, I didn't, it's not like I went and bought a bunch of stuff, but 25% off. That means I get a discount for all the from all these robots. Okay, cool. Guy in there saying something along the lines of, uh, yeah, look, let's see, this is ridiculous. 
It's built into the franchise agreement, but the gallery isn't even working. Okay, so what's the point? Well, serving a purpose now. I, I don't care if I'm the only customer. Well, let's, I'm pretty much maxed out on inventory anyway. I can't carry any more, and my dog can't carry any more, so... Let's get back to somewhere and go, uh... Welcome to the General Atomics Galleria. Put all this junk up and... Maybe build a few things. That's cool, man. That's totally worth it, man. Totally worth it. Like I said, we'll try to remember to come back and check that bowling alley. Just curious. P probably nothing's going to change, but uh, you never know. They might clean the place up and actually make it work. Make a settlement out of it, and you could actually have, like, settlers and stuff in there bowling and relaxing. And <laughs> Just imagine. Be interesting to see if a workbench popped up in that place later on. I don't know. Anyway, all right, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, click that button up top. If you want to catch the rest of this Let's Play, click that image in the middle. It should send you straight to the playlist. Appreciate you all hanging in there, and I will see you guys in the next one. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.